Let's learn how to multiply polynomials. The first thing we do when we multiply polynomials is we use the distributive property. And then we combine like terms when necessary. For example, let's multiply 2x squared and 3x squared minus x plus 4. The first thing we'll do is distribute this monomial to each of the three terms in the trinomial. which gives us 2x squared times 3x squared plus 2x squared times negative x plus 2x squared times 4, which is equal to 2 times 3 is 6, and then times x to the fourth. Because the bases are the same, we add the exponents. And then minus 2x cubed. And finally, plus 8x squared. And since there's no like terms to combine, this would be our answer. All right, let's look at another example. Let's multiply this binomial and this trinomial. The first thing we'll do is distribute the entire binomial to each of these three terms in the trinomial. That is, this is equal to x squared plus 1 times 2x squared plus x squared plus 1 times negative 3x plus x squared plus 1 times 4. And now we're going to use the distributive property again and distribute this 2x squared to each of these two terms, the negative 3x to each of these two terms, as well as the 4 to each of these two terms, which gives us x squared times 2x squared plus 1 times 2x squared plus x squared times negative 3x plus 1 times negative 3x plus x squared times 4 and finally plus 1 times 4. And multiplying all these out gives us 2x to the fourth plus 2x squared minus 3x cubed minus 3x plus 4x squared plus 4. Now in this example, we do have like terms to combine, don't we? We have this 2x squared and this 4x squared, which are like terms. So we will need to combine them. So this is equal to 2x to the fourth, and then we have the minus 3x cubed term. And now combining these x squared terms, we have plus 6x squared, and then we still have the minus 3x and plus 4. So this would be our answer here. All right, and this is how we multiply polynomials. We use the distributive property as well as combining like terms when necessary. Thank you, and we'll see you next time.